Does that support include sending some U.S. service members to help train Taiwanese troops? Well, yes. Um, uh, we have uh, a wide range of cooperation with the U.S. Uh, uh, aiming at uh, uh, increasing our defense capability. How many U.S. service members are deployed in Taiwan right now? Um, not as many as uh, uh, people thought. President Biden's promise during his CNN town hall, the United States, he said, will defend Taiwan if it is attacked by China. The White House later walked back those remarks, but now Taiwan's president tells CNN she is confident the U.S. would step up if Beijing tried to make a move on the democratic island. The mainland's massive military, two million strong, more powerful than ever. China flew 150 warplanes near Taiwan in just five days this month. This democracy of more than 23 million governed separately from the mainland for more than 70 years since the end of China's civil war, still seen as a breakaway province in the eyes of Beijing's communist rulers who have never controlled the island. Is Taiwan more safe today than it was when you became president in 2016? If it's a threat from China, it's increasing every day. Does that support include sending some U.S. service members to help train Taiwanese troops? Well, yes. Um, uh, we have uh, a wide range of cooperation with the U.S. Uh, uh, aiming at uh, uh, increasing our defense capability. How many U.S. service members are deployed in Taiwan right now? Um, not as many as uh, uh, people thought. Defense Department records show the number of U.S. troops in Taiwan increased from 10 in 2018 to 32 earlier this year. The State Department asked for more Marines to safeguard the unofficial U.S. Embassy in Taipei. Are you interested in speaking with President Xi? Would you like to have more communication with him? Well, more communication would be helpful so that we would uh, reduce misunderstanding, given our differences, uh, differences in terms of our political systems. Um, we can sit down and talk about our differences and try to make arrangement um, so that we would be able to coexist peacefully. Your predecessor, as you know, did meet with President Xi. Uh, why do you think that things, the communication has really gone south since 2016? Well, I think the situation has changed a lot, and, and China's plan uh, towards the region is very different. Do you have faith that the United States would defend Taiwan if the mainland were to try to move on Taiwan? I do have faith, and uh, given the long-term relationship that we have the U.S., and also the support of the people of the U.S. as well as the Congress, and the administration has been very helpful. We have to expedite our military reform so that we have uh, a, the ability to defend ourselves. And uh, given the size of Taiwan compared to the size of, of, of the PRC, um, developing asymmetric capability is the key for us.